Hey guys, B. Haynes here. So, I've been doing some major, major drugstore hauling. So, I've got some good stuff to show you. Um, I'll try to make it like super quick and run through everything so the video doesn't run like really, really long. But I always try that and I don't know, most of the time I don't make it. So, we'll see what happens. So, um, let's see. Mo the majority of the stuff I got is from Rite Aid. If you don't know, um, Rite Aid has an awesome cosmetics return policy. Like if you buy something and it's not the right color or you decide like you just hate it, um, you can bring it back. So always save the packaging if you buy a cosmetic product from Rite Aid. Just save the packaging and the receipt and you can bring it back I believe within 30 days. So that's really awesome. Um, okay, and they've got an awesome sale on right now. So if you live near Rite Aid, check your circular that you get in the mail. If you don't get a circular in the mail, then um, go online to RiteAid.com and you can put in your zip code and it'll tell you the circular for your area because I'm not sure if all the same the sales are the same <laughs> around the country or if they're different or what. Okay, so first up, sorry, grab some stuff. Um, they have Revlon lip and nail products on sale. Um, buy one, get the second one 50% off. So I didn't get any nail polish this time. I just stuck to lip glosses. So I got four. Um, and these are Revlon um, Super Lustrous. So the first one is called Nude Luster. It's just like a basic nude but I didn't have like a good nude um, lip gloss like without any glitter or anything in it so I like that and the next one is called foils and you know I'm so into like coppers and golds and stuff so it's like pretty coppery it's got little teeny tiny little gold flecks in it it looks a lot like um, Mac O Baby and the next one is called Pink Afterglow. So this one's like a pearlized, like hot pink. It's showing up red in the camera because of course it auto adjusts the color, but um, it's like hot pink with mm, like little gold and silver flecks in it. And then the last one is called Shine City. So it's just a really, really shiny um, clear lip gloss with like silver flecks. So, uh, I believe those were like $6.99 and then they're buy one, um, get the second one half off. So, you get two for like ten fifty plus tax. Okay, next up, um, trying out some Wet n Wild stuff. I love Wet n Wild only because it's like super cheap. Um, and for some reason it's always on sale at Rite Aid. It's cheap and then they throw it on sale on top of that. So, um, it's always like good stuff to just experiment with and try out. And they make some pretty good products, so. Um, so I'm trying out these Wet n Wild Perfect Pair uh, Eye Wands and Liner Combos. So these were $1.99, but they're on sale for 40% off. So um, I think they come up to like $1.60. So I got six of these. And the first one is called Blue Sky. And so the shadow pencil is on one side, and then um, on the other end, there is like a an eyeliner. So I think the eyeliner color is like a like a shade or two darker than the eyeshadow color. And this one is called Ying Yang, and it's a white shadow, but I believe the liner is black. The next one is called Black Slate. And this is like a silver shadow. I can't see what the liner is, but I'm going to guess it's probably either like charcoal or black. Um, the next one is just called Bronze Toast. Move back. It's like the same color as my uh, curtain behind me. It's really bronzy. And then the... Um, eyeliner is like a deeper bronze so that looks cool the next one is called champagne it's kind of close to the last one I just got but it's a little more gold and then the um, eyeliner is like dark brown 
And then, lastly, Central Peach. So this is obviously a peach color, and the eyeliner looks like, like a soft pink. And then I got four of these Wet n Wilds um, eyeshadow singles. And this one's called Envy. It's like a deep green. I love green. This one is called Nettie. And it looks kind of like, kind of like, a, like an almond. It's like almond brown. This one's called Penny. And of course, it's like a you know coppery color. And the last one is called Kitten, um, and it's like a, like a dark lilac, light lavender color. And those were um, $1.99, so with 40% off, those were $1.60 as well. And then lastly, let's see, I think this is the last thing for went while. I got um, one lipstick, because I'd never tried out their lipstick, so I just decided to get one. Um, and it was $0.99. Cents. They don't have names. This one is like a kind of a champagne color. The plastic is like really glaring. Um, and it's 547B. Um, so I'm just going to try it out. I'll see. And if I like it, then I'll get some other colors. And then, oh, I was mistaken. I do have some Wet n Wild nail polishes. So I got the Wet n Wild Wild Shine. And these are always 99 cents set. Right, eight. These were not on sale, but they're 99 cents, so they don't really need to be on sale. So, this is deep purple color I got. Um, it's called Eggplant Frost. And then I got a pastel pink, and it's called Tickle Pink. And then this one, which is like red and has these really cool, like pink and gold flecks in it. It's called Jezebel. Hmm. So, <laughs> let's see. And then I got Blazed. And this one's like, it's showing up orange on camera, but it's a mix between like pink and orange. Kind of melony, but if you hold it in a certain light, then it's pink. So, that one should be pretty cool. It's kind of holographic. And then the last one I got is called Blue Moon. So, it's a really deep blue, and it has... Um, like silver or blue flex in it. So that should be cute. Okay, so that really is it for the wet and wild. Um, and then they have sinful colors nail polish on sale. I have so many of these that I only bought two. Um, because I feel like all the colors that I like I already had, and then the other colors I don't like so much. So the two I got were Casablanca. Not that I need another silver polish, but. This one is a little, like, duller than my other ones. I usually get, like, really glittery silver polish, and this one doesn't have much glitter in it, so I like it. And then this one, um, it's called Under 18. Ooh. And it's a really, really deep, like, garnet. It's, like, ruby red. And these are $1.99, but they're on sale, um, I believe, buy one, get one half off. So then, I also got um, a couple of CoverGirl products. CoverGirl was also on sale, buy one, get one half off. So I got CoverGirl True Blend Minerals. Um, this is 440 Natural Bronze. So I have never, ever tried this, so I'm going to see. Like, hopefully, um, it looked cute through the packaging. And this is the darkest bronzer that they have in the True Blend series. So it comes with a little powder brush, powder puff, but I don't use that, you know. Um... So I'll see. And then I got some liquid foundation. This is CoverGirl Nature Lux. And this color is 365. And it says it's new. So I'm going to try it out. Um, I tested it on my hand because I sneak and open things <laughs> in the drugstore to see if I like it um, or to see, you know, kind of find out what my color is. So I'll see what happens. If not, I'll take it back. And what else did I get? Oh, I'm going to try out this CoverGirl Makeup Masters Mineral Powder Brush. So I'm going to try it out with that um, mineral bronzer and see what happens. Like, it's flat on the top, so it looks like a stippling brush. So, 
Um, it was like $6.99 or something like that. So I'm just going to try it out and see if it works. And I got a couple of Black Radiance products. So I got this um, Black Radiance Complexion Perfection Shine Control Primer. Now I have yet to find a good drugstore primer. Um, I just never have. And I usually use like high-end products even you know uh, from Mac or for, from Sephora but I'm on the hunt for a cheap drugstore primer so I'm gonna try this out and there was only one left on the rack which leads me to believe a lot of people buy it normally if I see there's only one left I automatically assume that it's good so I'm gonna try it out and I'll do a review on it and let you guys know what I think and then um, I got a clear mascara and brow, brow tamer it was like, I don't know, three bucks. So, okay, and then I got some brushes. I'm going to try out these Eco Tools. Um, I see them all the time, right, at Walmart, Target. They sell them everywhere, but I don't know how good they are. I did sneak and open the packaging in the store. And the brushes felt really, really soft. So it led me to believe that they might be pretty good. Now I got this set right here. It comes, it's a six piece bamboo brush set. So it comes with a um, blush brush, an eye shading brush, which is this one, a eyeliner brush, a concealer brush, and then a brow brush. And this brush right here this powder brush is really really super soft so the and then it comes with a brush roll which I won't use but it's cool that it comes with it and the whole set was $10.99 so I'm gonna try it out and just you know test it and see and if it works I'll let you know um, then I got this eyeshadow brush and this is like the you know the big mop head um, wider brush it's different than the one that the shader brush that comes in the kit so I got this and it was like $3.99 so I'm gonna try it out always on the hunt for <laughs> brushes you never have too many brushes and it's really soft um, and really dense so that's a good sign and there was only one left of those too so and then this right here now I have a feeling this is gonna be an awesome brush this is the Eco Tools bamboo bronzer brush and I just love this it's like a kabuki brush but it's really long I love it the handle is huge and I have really long fingers and this brush is so so soft and it's really really full and really dense so I know that this is going to be awesome and this brush was $9.99 so I think it's going to be great. I'm excited about using that. Okay, then I have a few other things I'll run through because I've seen the times wearing up. I got a handful of shadows from the Dollar Tree and they're LA Colors. Um, and they have mineral eyeshadow now. So I think this is new because this is um, the first I've seen it. But I got black gold they don't have any catchy names they're just you know regular names um teal which is really pretty beige purple and that was the end for the eyeshadows and then i'm going to try out this bronzer and it's uh la colors expressions and this one is in bronze glow so i'll let you know how that one Turns out, and doo -doo -doo -doo. and lastly, I found this brush from the clearance rack at Marshalls, and it's by Gotta Be Urban Designer Collection Angle Brush, and it was on clearance for three bucks. It is so cute, it's awesome, and the bottom is snakeskin, so I thought that was like the cutest thing ever for three bucks. I don't think it's real snakeskin, but I love it, and it's super duper, super duper soft. So, I'll have fun using that. So, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and comment. And I'll have some giveaways coming up all throughout the month of May. So, stay tuned. Until then, happy shopping.